Describe G2 Crew. Uh, I guess. What's one word to describe this team? G2 Crew is goofy and rewarding. It's discipline for me. It's a challenge to overcome, and uh, I love it every day. Um, I describe G2 Crew as one big fun family. Being a new student here and a freshman on the team, I couldn't have asked for a more supportive and wonderful family than what I've had at GT Crew. But if I had one word to describe GT Crew, I would say colorful. We're a lot of different people and come from a lot of different places and we have a lot of different things going on at one time. It's a group of people that have always been there for me in an emotional sense, in a physical sense. They push me to be my very best every day and they support me and have helped me become the person that I am now. GT Crew for me is just one big family. I think the one thing that drove me to join GT Crew is the emphasis on not needing prior experience. You know, we're all getting the same experience and the same um, first times for everything. And one word, I'd say family. I think I joined this team thinking like it would be just something fun I'd do on the weekends. I'd get in a workout occasionally and it'd just be a chance to like do a sport, get on water, be on a team. But I joined and then you kind of form this bond with all these people that you're just spending all this time with. They become your friends, they become part of like your community and you really just learn to love this team of like 60 plus people, every single one of them. You just form this one big family. It was, it was definitely fun going from being a rower to being a coach. Um, I, feel, I feel like a lot of it is, you know, we kind of lost, lost some of our years uh, during COVID. And so I, I kind of feel like I, I missed out a little bit on, on some of those fast years that we would have had, but I, it's, it's kind of given me peace to be able to come back here and kind of, you know, help, help these guys get faster, you know, help, help build George Tech as a team and, you know, help, help them get to, get to the team, you know, where it used to be and hopefully much further beyond that. I don't know, that's a really hard question because it's, I'm coming up on my 10th year with this team overall, like being involved as either like a rower, a coach, an alumni board member. Um, and it's just been like this massive force in my life where I've met like really important people that are still around, um, came into a sport that I'd never tried before and I was not an athlete before either. So it was a new way to kind of like have a different relationship with my body and what it could do. Um, and then just like be competitive at something and, and work harder towards something bigger with a, a big group of people that I cared about. So it's been really important. It's fun being on the other side. It's fun like I'm still learning myself how to coach. I think it probably makes me an even better rower. I see a lot in them that I remember from my novice year. Um, and so it's, they're a joy to work with and it's just awesome to see them grow every day and bring this outstanding positive energy to every practice. I would say scrappy. Um, it's always a team that's trying to do a lot with uh, what we've got, which is sometimes new boats, sometimes old boats. Um, oftentimes competing against teams with a lot more money, a lot more resources, a lot closer boathouse, a lot more water in their river, and we just have to go out there and do the best with what we've got. I would describe GT Crew as an inclusive, loving environment where um, everyone looks out for each other. We're friends both in the boat and at practice, but also outside of it in school, and so that's a really nice thing to be a part of. Picking up rowing for the first time was really hard, but it's been very rewarding being a part of this team. You know, one, one thing I like about Georgia Tech is that we're, we're scrappy as hell, um, you know. We're going against all these teams who are rowing out of their fancy boat houses, rowing with their, you know, erg shacks and their really nice million dollar boat houses. And, and we're here sitting sitting in a tent. We row out of a tent. We're pretty much camping when we go to the boat house every day. But I think that's, that's what makes us us. We're really like building more towards a, a stronger future for the team. Um, and again, I think culture wise, like, yes, we have stuff to work on. Um, but the direction of it, I think, is moving towards like a healthier space and something that will keep people around and keep them wanting to try harder. And, and we're just gonna keep growing together and I'm excited.